the out of position program in Madden is my favorite program in Madden and in any other ultimate team game mode, whether it's like 2K, MLB, whatever it might be, this is the best program. Thank you guys so much for all of the support on the channel in the recent videos. If you're new around here, go ahead and hit that like and subscribe button. Both are free and uh, it helps me grow the channel and also helps you guys be able to find my other content which hopefully can help make your Madden team better. This year's out of position players masters are 95 overall. Deion Sanders and 95 overall. Calvin Johnson. Now, those two in their own rights are very good. One is a very talented corner and the other the best wide receiver in NFL history. But they they don't have those. They don't play there anymore. With that, you know, that's kind of the whole point of the out of position sets. Um, so let's go ahead and look at them. You know, that dramatic pause was very good. I practiced it. I actually practiced probably. I've been sitting here for four hours this morning just practicing it. It's true. Very true. Uh, we'll look at Calvin Johnson first because that one is um, the one I'm more interested in. This one, he's going to be at free safety. So, whoo wee You know. Oh, shit. I forgot, you can't look him up on the auction house. Well, ain't that a stinking turd. Alright, so we'll go ahead and look at the sets, and I'll bring him up on Mutthead, because, you know, I can't think of any way else to look at them. Yeah, very professional, I know. But, eh, who cares. Alrighty. Oh, we went way too far. It's literally the first one. Out of position. It's a snowball fight. That's, that's going to be fun to look at. There you go, wide receiver and free safety. Calvin Johnson, I think he just came out recently. So, to get Calvin Johnson, you've got to get um, 13. you got to get all 13 of these players. Um. <laughs> Sorry, I'm trying to look for this. Where's Calvin? There you go, Calvin. Oh, there might just be nobody on the auction house. Anyway, um, you've got to get a Dory Jackson, which is my boy Logan. You know, I love shouting him out. He, this is his pick um, for, you know, kind of like the best of the sets. He thinks this guy is really good at Dory Jackson. Taking a quick look at him. Why is he a deep threat? 90 for speed. You can see why he likes him. Uh, 93 deep route running, so he's definitely going to be a deep threat also has 87 catching 83 catching traffic for those posts and streaks um anything else he's got i believe that's 91 jumping so uh be able to get up there and get some of those balls um pretty good card so that is logan's pick you know we always got to uh talk about him because that's pretty much my job at this point Hey, yeah, no, you can buy uh, Callan Johnson. I guess there's just not one on the uh, auction house right now. All right, the second one out of these sets, Landon Collins. Eh, you got to get Landon, not too good. It's left outside linebacker, so it's not too much. It's not a great card. It's not super fun, but it should be pretty fast. Now, speaking of a fun card, Ben Roethlisberger, but uh, if you couldn't tell from the picture, he is now a punter. Um, that elbow that he has savagely torn so many times from uh yeah i figured it's over um you know from his personal life if you know you know um but now he's a punter and he doesn't actually have to do that uh 83 kick power 88 kick accuracy but he's a power punter that's all that matters uh this should be a fun card to get and also if you look out for guys getting this card for fake punts and stuff like that i'm sure you're going to see a video on this uh, so try him out for yourself. Obviously, he's still got the good throwing ac uh, throwing attributes. It's not insane as like an 87 actual quarterback Ben Roethlisberger, but 84 throw power, uh, 81 short accuracy. That's not too bad. He can throw on the run still. 
Um, doesn't have any speed at 65, but uh, you'll definitely see him with some fake plays, some fake punts. And, I mean, who doesn't want Ben Roethlisberger pinning the other team on the one? I sure do. I think it'd be fun. And the last one's actually Lynn Bowden Jr. at quarterback. Um, as you can see, it's really cheap, but this guy could be really glitchy all because he has 91 speed. Uh, is 84 throw of power, so that's all right. He does have 83 throw on the run. Um, this is definitely going to be scrambling quarterback, no doubt about it. But this could be a really fun card to play with. It could be really glitchy. Again, that 91 speed would get you places. It's pretty much a budget l version of Lamar Jackson. Um, but it's Lynn Bowden Jr., and not everybody knows who that is. And you might be able to catch some guys sleeping on him. Overall... You know, that set's pretty fun. I like a lot of those players. And obviously this Calvin Johnson is insane. I've got the stats for you. 93 man, 99 zone, 99 jump. Jump ball. He's got 89 range, or 98 range, 99 hands, 95 run support, and 94 physical. Um, that's kind of their ratings. So his actual ratings is 92 speed, 91 acceleration. Um... 83 man coverage, which is kind of low. 94 zone coverage, there you go. 95 jumping, 95 awareness, and 95 play recognition, that's pretty good. Um, run defensively, um, 71 block shutting, that's not too good. 90 pursuit, that's good. 87 tackling, should get the job done. 87 hit power, my man's is insane. Alright, and we'll go look at the Deion Sanders of this, uh, that because he's pretty good in his own right he's probably you know it's up in the air I mean I like them both I think they're both going to be insane but I think a lot of people think that the uh, Deion Sanders is a little better but um, he's just a little cheaper since he came out first we'll go ahead and click on him uh, but we'll start from the bottom here and Barkivius Mingo um, tight end he's kind of He's a bit different. He's not going for much if you need a backup tight end. Uh, he's actually a middle linebacker, so this one's just kind of fun, but it'd be better if, you know, it was like a J.J. Watt, somebody who's actually significant. No offense to Barkevius Mingo, but eh, he's all right. So many of good tight ends have came out recently. You don't really have to worry about it. Um, speaking of good tight ends, I think the next one is a very good tight end. But he plays middle linebacker. I really want to get this card. Rob Gronkowski, 87 overall field general middle linebacker. Definitely going to be fun to play with. Oh, okay. Uh, the only issue is his speed. Speed something. Uh, he has a pass coverage middle linebacker. 87 speed sometimes. Um can get you into some issues. I think for now, 87 speed is good enough. Uh, he's got 80 tackling. That's all right. Play recognition, 87. Block shedding, 85. 90 hit power, 86. Zone coverage, that'll be nice. Um, and if it'll show me his man coverage, I believe he will be just fine against running back. 72 man coverage, not as high as you'd like it to be. But I think it'll be just enough to get it done. I mean, his size is just unbelievable at this middle linebacker position. 6'6", 255. Uh, you know, he'll be really good on crosser routes and stuff. He might not have the speed to get to them. But uh, anything over the middle, you know, that little hook over in mesh. Uh, where you have that middle hook. He'll be able to get to that really easily, especially with that height. He'll be able to swat it down. And he could be a really good blitzer, to be honest. Uh, with that height, you know, he'll be able to bat some balls down, hopefully. That's if EA's game works properly. But don't get your hopes up. Uh, I believe we've got one more card to talk about before we get to Dion Prime Time. Nope, we got two more. I forgot. Julian Edelman, corner. Um, this is alluding to um, when Tom Brady would underthrow him and Julian Edelman would get in there and swat that shit. He's also played on defense a little bit, so, but, you know. He's actually a zone corner, which isn't terrible. Uh, 90 speed, kind of slow. 93 excel, though. 90 zone coverage, 87 man coverage, so you definitely can. I uh, get there. He's got good play recognition at 90, but 60 press. That's kind of an issue. 
Um, probably can't man him up too much. Definitely not in a uh, any like cover one press. Um, decent agility. That's not too big of an issue. He can catch the ball where you kind of hope. Eh, not that good. Let's be honest. And. The final one, probably the most fun card besides that Ben Roethlisberger. Ladainian Tomlinson at quarterback. My man has threw tons of touchdowns when he was a when he was on the Chargers. My man Tomlinson has 92 speed, 88 throw power, 93 short accuracy, um, 88 medium accuracy, and 77 deep accuracy. Won't be able to throw the ball uh, accurately deep. Does have nice throw. Uh, under pressure at 88 and also throw on the run. He's going to be a scram scrambler like Lynn Bowden Jr., but he'll be a better version and a way more fun version. Um, he obviously still has all of the good running attributes. Um, I'm interested to see how the carrying works, if they're going to make him fumble randomly just because he's now a quarterback, because um, he should have not really good carrying, 91 carrying. You could put trust on him, but... Um, you definitely want to put uh, those pocket stuff like escape pocket and all those, um, d uh, ro what is it, dashing dead eye, roaming dead eye, whatever it is. You definitely want to put those on here um, because, you know, he's insane. And uh, Neon Dion Sanders, prime time, 95 speed at the wide receiver position. 95 excel, 95 agility for those who care, 92 jump, 95 awareness, 90 catching, 93 catch in traffic, um, 95 short route running, 91 medium out running, and 91 deep route running, definitely a route runner, um, it'll say it on the card as his uh, archetype, 93 release, uh, 95 95 change of direction still got 90 ball carry vision for whatever that's worth 92 break tackle um, and has got 90 spin and 94 juke literally an insane card I'm um, looking at the stats it's hard to pass up on this um, Calvin's great personally for myself if I'm going for one I'm gonna be going for a neon Dion prime time uh, because I've got some nice free safeties I got some nice backhand help but this Deion Sanders is insane. Um, if you guys want a video going over the Ghost of Madden, I should be able to work on that soon. I still got to learn a little more about the snowball fight. Still haven't figured it out completely, but we'll be able to talk about that soon. Zero Chill, there's a few more sets, I think. I think they added one more. Uh, Bobby Wagner, uh, 95. We can maybe talk about that uh, in a different video, of course. Because this one is getting kind of long. So if you guys enjoyed, please let me know in the comment section if this helped you or not. Uh, any video ideas, stuff that you guys want to see on this channel. And uh, with that being said, Mike Gasicki is the best uh, tight end in the league. You heard it here. I mean, just look at him. Look at him holding on to that ball. He's cradling that shit like it's a baby. Alright, I'll see you next time.